Earlier today, DE announced a developer workshop on the Kuvalich system. We can expect the following changes to come as early as next week on PC, and for Xbox One and PlayStation 4, you could possibly get it in that same week, so just watch out for that. Now before we get to the changes, DE prefaced the announcement of these changes by saying the following. If you watch DevStream 136, the 2019 player summary showed us that out of the 27,000 responses, the Kuvalich system was the 2019 edition that was enjoyed the least. Many players voiced that the Kuvalich system got progressively less fun the more time and energy was devoted to it. While finding the line between repetition and progress is one Warframe has struggled with since its first day, Liches highlighted some issues we aim to address while walking that line. Alright, so for the changes, Kuva Larvelings will act the same as they did before, however you will be able to see what Kuva weapon will roll for that Larveling when you convert it into a Lich by of course executing it with your Parazon, with an icon above its head when it's in its down but not out state, it will show an icon that will be the weapon that will be generated. At this point the player will be able to spawn the Lich by executing it, and if you choose to walk away and it dies, you will get 100 Kuva at the end of the mission. They will also be changing how the Kuva Liches interact with us the player when we fail a Parazon stab. As of the upcoming change, Kuva Liches will no longer kill you when you fail a Parazon stab. The Parazon animation will play like usual, but the UI will show whether it was a success or a failure. If it's a failure, the Kuva Lich will laugh at you and then leave the battlefield. The next change will come to the Valence Transfer System. Valence Transfer now also boosts your Kuva Weapon's innate damage bonus. Your Kuva Com with 25% damage can be infused into your 40% weapon to make 44%. Your Kuva Com with 40% damage can be infused into your 25% weapon to make 44%, and your Kuva Com with 25% can be infused into your 44% weapon to make it 48.4%. Your Kuva weapon duplicates now offer a gradual progression towards a perfect Kuva weapon, which would reflect a 60% damage value, if of course you choose to pursue this path. We can also expect the chance of a Kuva Lich having an ephemera to double, the converted Liches will stay longer, do more damage and actually use their abilities, and on top of that we will also see two new Kuva weapons coming soon. Now, we can't expect the Lich Be Gone system, they said the following as to why. We have removed the prototype for this for now, because rather than not fixing the core loop and just letting a Lich be banished, we intend to focus on the core loop first. Since duplicates are now opt-in and have more value for a min-maxer, there's less of a reason to dispel a Lich. And then they finish the post by saying, The major questions remaining to be answered include Kuva Lich plus Railjack and other faction Liches. Until we complete part 2 of this workshop, we won't have much to discuss on this front, but stay tuned. So that ends the developer workshop, the Kuvalich changes that are upcoming as soon as next week on PC and possibly Xbox One and PlayStation 4. It's good to be back, enjoy making this stuff, so I'll see you guys in the next video, which will possibly be a catch-up video because I have a few to make, and then we'll go back to our normal YouTube upload schedule, which is whatever is new in Warframe, cover it, patch notes, last week in Warframe, all of that jazz, Warframe archives, Warframe history. Uh, we'll see you guys next time. Thanks for watching. It's good to be back.